Welcome my friends, so glad you could join me. My name is Wonka and today we are going to be playing Car Mechanic Simulator 2015. 2015, Jesus Murphy this game is old. Could we get a new one? Huh? Fuck a train simulator. Am I if you guys want to see more Car Mechanic Simulator 2015 in the future, be sure to hit that like button, leave me a comment. It's all right there. And I'll wait. Just, just hit the like, don't, don't, you know, don't even hit, everybody smashes and hits the like button, it's so cliche, let's just click it like a normal person, okay, let's, let's all together, right now, just gently go over, we don't want to break our mouse, the, the, the like button didn't do anything to us, let's just, nice little click, okay, so I hope you guys enjoy, and I think you will, so I want to just start off by saying thank you all so much who watched the last Car Mechanic Simulator with the update, Got a lot of great feedback on it. You guys watched the hell out of it. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick special thank you for that. And obviously, thank you for liking it. Thank you for subscribing. You guys are wonderful. So, also, before we get down to business here, um, which all we're really doing today is painting this white, which I, I just wanted to point out, we already have a white car. So maybe we shouldn't do this white. I'll do it white anyway. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I'm gonna put the white walls on it and stuff. It's gonna be beautiful. Um, but before we do, you guys probably are wondering about my car. I was gonna tell you today, but I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off for one more car mechanic simulator just to give you guys a chance because I feel I feel like I cheated you guys just a little bit, just a smidge. I I wanted to make it harder than it probably already is. You know what? What's where's the fun? If there's no challenge. So technically, yes, I do drive a Nissan. It is technically made and owned by Nissan. But as you might have guessed from the first half of this sentence, it's an Infinity, not a Nissan. That's why I kind of feel like I cheated you guys. You guys were probably only thinking Nissans and not thinking, oh, yeah, that's, like, you know, vice versa. So I'll give you guys one more chance to guess. Place your guesses. Comments below. Maybe another hint is... The same car is a Nissan in Europe, so I wasn't fully cheating you, all right? <sighs> Don't you just love trick games, trick questions like those tests? Did you ever get those tests as a kid where the teacher's like, make sure you read the whole test before starting it? And let's be real, nobody reads the whole goddamn test before starting it. You just start and you make your way through. But at the end of the test, after these ridiculously hard questions... It says you don't actually have to do any of these questions, just hand it in and blah, blah, blah. It's the stupidest thing. I'm sure there's a lesson in there somewhere, but enough about that. I'm, I'm, I'm done reliving my, my school days. Get the fuck in the fucking basement, dust collector piece of shit. Ta-da! All right, I kind of cheated you guys a little bit. As I was going through, I didn't want to make it pearly white just because that car was already pearly white. So I wanted to give it a little bit of tint of something. I might have given it a little too much tint of something. You gotta remember, the lighting in there makes the paint look different than the lighting out here. Which, I guess this is supposed to be daylight because of all these windows. But anyway, I, I kind of gave it a little bit of cream. Do you guys like it? If, if you like it, then um, we'll keep it. If you don't like it, well then just yell at me in the comments and be like, you ruined it. You ruined it. Um, you gotta say it like that, though. You gotta say it like a whiny little kid. Like, you ruined it! Okay? Make sure make sure you convey that through text. So, yeah, I threw the white walls back on it. Now she's a nice little peachy cream color. <laughs> I don't know. I like it. I think it looks classy and old, and it's almost white, like you guys said. So, you know, looks good with the red interior, too, I think. The black, that was another popular suggestion, would have probably also looked fucking awesome. So if you guys don't like the cream, and we don't want white because that one's already white, maybe we'll give it a nice black. Um, also, I was told that we can probably get a better time without the slicks because the slicks provide too much grip, slowing this slow thing down. So, we uh, can take it out with our new white walls later. Let's see, see, if, see how she does. So, today... Obviously, we did old school, now we gotta do new school. We got ourselves the other Bentley of the DLC, the Bentley Continental GT. You can't see it, but I'm wiggling my eyebrows. So yeah, I got, got this puppy for about a cool 52 grand. It's only worth 51.5, but that's okay. I mean, I, 
we're, we're rich now, right? Oh, oh, I didn't know that was hiding in there. Let's let's close that again. Hey guys, look at this! Did not know that you were hiding in here, but it's nice to see you. I don't know if you notice, but when I hit this button, which is the swap engine, as you can see right here, it shows the W12, and it'll show other engines. Normally, there's like maybe two options. One's like turboed, one's not. One's supercharged, one's not. It's pretty minimal, but... There's this empty swap button that I can check. So not only are we going to build this, race it, race that too. We're going to put new school against old school. Obviously, new school is going to win. It's not about that competition. It's just to see the difference. Look at those seats too. Bentley likes red, apparently. Looks like a Christmas car. Is this Santa's? Santa Claus? Did you lend me this? So yeah, we're going to see if we can take that W12, throw it in there. All hell will break loose if it works. W wish me luck. All right, let's just let's just do it. Was there anything else I wanted to tell you? Maybe. Nah, that's probably it. What the fuck? change. Didn't do any other fucking maintenance though.
really hope they're working on a new car mechanic simulator. Because there's no other game like this on the market. And I really would like a new one. Who wants to start like a Kickstarter or something for them? <laughs> Force them to make us one. Who's with me? Let's start a riot. <laughs> But I think I see Mr. Moon sweating a little over here. Hanging out on his champion's pedestal, just just breaking a sweat. You nervous? I would be.
Can't even tell it's a Bentley anymore, but you can tell it's fast. <laughs> I like it, and I think there could be a battle brew in here. I know I said we were going to do this, which we will, but there could be a battle brew in here. So be sure to let me know in the comments what color you guys want to see it. Unfortunately, once again with these Bentleys, there is no other customization parts, but be sure to pick a good color. If you, if you want to know which colors I already have for cars, so you can pick one that we don't have yet, check out the last... No. It's called something down memory lane. Check out that video. Maybe I'll put a card here or whatever. YouTubers do that, right? I, I don't, but maybe there. So, before I forget, because I just remembered during that rant... Aha! See, I'm getting better. Learning. And before I forget as well, we got to put the slicks on. Because this thing is going to need it. Alright. To the dyno. Oh yeah. That's the sound I like to hear. Something that sounds like it will eat small children. Alright, she's tuned and ready to rock. Are you ready to rock? I want to rock. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Hit that 2K. Hit that 2K. You suck. You are useless! Worthless! Why is the moon so fast? Someone tell me right now! I'm telling you, this thing was made by NASA for space. NASA? NASA? NASA, get it? That's ridiculous! How is anything supposed to compete? Come on! You gotta at least implement one car that can p compete for me, please? Now, I just wanted to point something out that I thought of, because I figure this is genius, alright? Since we're on the topic of getting new car mechanic simulators, what do you guys think of this? Imagine, so here, we, we are at our garage. Now imagine, instead of coming to this map and just clicking and warping places, imagine this was a world that you could drive down these streets and go to these different places. You could go to a test track, you could maybe go to a race track, the auction center, whatever. All this shit, and you could just drive there and show up and it would be awesome. Developers, if you if you need help planning Car Mechanic Simulator 2017 or 18, my uh, contact email is in the description. <laughs> Alright, here we are. Let's do this. So we got our Bentley T this time. With the um, less sticky tires on. Had a much better start, that's for sure. I think I shifted the first gear a little early. Well, doesn't seem like we ever need to leave second gear. <laughs> wow, this thing is slow. Oh! That was... That was my bad. I was... I was itching my finger, and... Um, the car wasn't expensive, right? <laughs> No one's ever going to let me drive their Bentley now. Whew, that was riveting. 10 second... 0 to 100. <laughs> I think that was faster, though. Uh, let me know in the comments if it beat the car that it was facing in its episode, in the last episode there. Let me, let me know. Or if it was closer, at least. Let me know if it beat itself. Just let me know. Alright. The moment you've all been waiting for. We're back on the... The proper side here. <laughs> oh, man. I'm surprised I didn't start an argument last time I said that. It's because I have the best community on YouTube. That's why. Alright. Here we go. Place your bets. Who's gonna win? <laughs> Okay, 
I didn't I didn't realize it was gonna grip that quick. It's my my bad bad. My bad. Alright, hopefully I can get the timing better here. That was a bit better. Well, at least this thing had eight gears. Fuck, it's about time something didn't top out. Whoo! 2.4 seconds, zero to 100, and a nine second quarter mile. That's pretty damn good for a Bentley. Unfortunately, Mr. Moon is well in the clear, obviously. I mean, it's four wheel drive as well, puts out another fucking like 800 horse. So, we don't need to test that, but hey, I think that's pretty damn fucking good. I took both of their engines. I stole them. And now, if we're lucky, I should be able to hit empty swap. No! Well, I tried. I can't figure out this uh, empty swap thing, because this one's not grayed out. This one... This one is grayed out. So I figured, okay, maybe I could put the old shitty T-Series engine in here, right? So I came over here, hit empty swap, but it'll only let me put the W12 in, and I do have all of the T-Series stuff, as you can see here. There's the T-Series block, it won't let me put it in here though. Could have something to do with all-wheel drive versus not all-wheel drive, I don't know, but if you know how to do these empty swaps... Let me know in the comments, and I will be sure to do some fun engine swaps for you. But in the meantime, unfortunately, that's it, folks. If you guys want to see more Car Mechanic Simulator 2015 in the future, be sure to hit that like button. Leave me a comment. It's all right there. And it's the best way of letting me know that you're not done and you want to see more of anything on my channel. That's, that's how you communicate best with me. Relationships work best with communication. As always, if you haven't, be sure to subscribe if you're feeling friendly. And standing in church with your Bible doesn't make you any more Christian than standing in a garage with a wrench makes you a mechanic. Take her easy. Hey, big spender. Spend a little time with me. Make sure you hit that like button, because if you guys hit the like button for me, lots of good things happen, okay? And we can grow and do giveaways and, like, subscribe and all that good stuff, okay? Take her easy. <laughs>